How to balance APCL3 plus KSCN that produce APSCN3 plus KCL. This is look in the left hand side we have iron that is 1 then chlorine 3 then potassium 1 and SCN is a polyatomic ion this is called thiocyanate and this is 1 in the right hand side iron is 1. SCN thiocyanate is 3 and potassium is 1 and chlorine is 1. So now balance. Iron 1, 1, so iron is balanced. Chlorine here 3, here 1, so chlorine is not balanced. So to balance chlorine, what can you do? You can multiply here by 3, that gives you 3. If you multiply by something, that something must come before the atom, that is here, before this chlorine here. But this chlorine has come from here, so you have to place here, you have to place here 3. This, this 3 will come here uh, before this chlorine and this chlorine has come from here, so you have to place here 3 as a coefficient. Now, the number of uh, potassium is 3, so let us change the number of potassium, the number of chlorine as you already have written. Now look. Chlorine 3, 3, but potassium here 1, here 3. So to balance potassium, I can multiply here by 3, that gives us 3. If you multiply by something, that something must come before the atom as coefficient. So you have to place here 3. And the number of potassium is 3, the number of thiocyanate is also 3. So now cyanide 3, 3, potassium 3, 3, chlorine 3, 3, and iron 1, 1. So you can say that this is the balanced chemical equation.